guys, it's me, Thriftastic Mom. I'm here to do a Goodwill haul for you guys today. I actually just got back probably about 30 minutes ago and took everything out. And I'm like, sit down, make a video right quick and show you guys what I got at Goodwill today. I actually just went to one Goodwill today and I just had to go run some errands. So I stopped by one on the way home and picked up some goodies. So I thought I'd share them with you right quick. Put my glasses on where I can see. First thing I picked up from the Goodwill was this pack of AA batteries. They had a bunch of them in a little end cap, so I went ahead and grabbed some of those. Hopefully, they're still good and work great. I don't know if they have a date on them or not. I didn't even look. But anyway, I picked up those for two bucks. Picked up a couple coffee mugs, because y'all know I like my coffee mug. This one is by Opal House. It's called Porcelain Mug. And I thought it was cute because it has donuts on it. See the donuts around it? On the front of the cup it says, Donuts Stop Believing. I thought that was cute. Really nice size cup. These are like brand new. So they were charging $2 a piece for these. I think they might have come from Target or somewhere. Yeah, Target corporation a really cute mug so I went in and paid two bucks for that since it's new and then I got a used one here and this is by Trissa and it was only 94 cents but I thought it was so cute and it's a really nice size cup it says caffeine time it's got it on both sides caffeine time I thought that was really cute it's got one little place right there. I don't know if you can see it, but that's no big deal. So I got that one for 94 cents. And let me show you the difference in size. I love big cups. See the difference? <laughs> I love those big cups like that. Even the lady that checked me out, she's like, oh, no, that's my, my size coffee cup right there. <laughs> Next thing I got were a pair of Engaro shoes i picked these up just to resell on ebay i thought they were really pretty and they're in really good shape let's see can you see you'll see that blue and black i thought those were so pretty really pretty all photos up on ebay i'm not sure what they're going for i'll have to look them up this kind and see what they're going for but look at the bottoms i mean they look like they've haven't even worn. <laughs> I did pay $6.50 for these because that is the price of most of the Goodwills around here is $6.50 for shoes. These are 7.5s. Really pretty. I love that blue and black. I'm trying to see if it has, I don't see where it has any other marking except what's on the bottom. Slip resistant. But yeah, those they don't even look like they've met, might not even been wore out of the house. There's no gravel in them or anything. So those are really nice. So I'll throw those up on eBay. Uh, let me show you the clothes I got right quick, and then I'll show you the last two things. I picked this up just because it was torrid. I'm trying to figure it out here. It's like a, it's like a crisscross plus size top. That's the way it does. Crisscrosses in the back. It almost looks like a bathing suit top. <laughs> but it's not. It's a blouse, I think. <laughs> I think it's a blouse. <laughs> okay. It's torrid size 4. It's got a couple numbers in here. I might have to look it up and make sure that it's not a bathing suit top. It might be. I'm not sure. But anyway, it crisscrosses in the back. <laughs> kind of like so. I don't know how I'm going to take a picture of this. <laughs> but it's pretty. It's black and white polka dots. I figure somebody would want that. Torrid usually sells pretty good. 
for me. And I'll have to look it up and see can I find it and make sure that it's not a bathing suit top. Or it can, you could wear it as a regular top. It, it don't really feel like a bathing suit top to me. <clears throat> but this shirt here is a Apartment 9 Modern Essentials V-neck. It's just a regular black V-neck. I actually got this for me. And it's pretty thin. I mean, you can see through it if you stretch it. I'll definitely wear a black bra with it. But it's just a V-neck. Nothing, nothing fancy. And I think I give like $4.75 for each of the shirts. And then this one I just loved. I'm not a big white wearer. But when I seen this one, I'm like, oh, that's cute. In Touch 3X. But look how pretty. Isn't that not pretty? I love that pink. It's pink and brown. Which I love pink and brown together. Look at that. That is so pretty. Even the cashier is like, oh, I love that blouse. It's beautiful. And I don't know if you could tell, but it does have... I'm trying to figure it out here. I don't know if you could tell, but it's got sparkle in it. I can't tell if it's picking up. But all across the top there is sparkle in it. <clears throat> So I love that one. So I picked all three of those shirts up for four seventy five. Those two were mine, and then I'll try to sell the torrid bathing suit top or a regular top, whatever it is. She charged me for a regular top. She asked me, was it a bathing suit top? I said, I'm not sure. So the last thing that I got, they had just put out some new toys out there on the one of the um, aisles. And I picked them up because y'all know I got two babies, two grandbabies, in uh, my family. <clears throat> and these are for when they're around 12 months old. But they had these cute little shape sorters. Still new in the pack. For 12 month olds. Got a little handle. So... I picked up two of them, one for one for um, Scarlet and one for Cash. And the only thing is when I got up there, I told her, I said, both of these has got two different prices. One's got $3.50 and the other one's got $2.50. And she said, well, it's according to who puts it out on the floor. But this one says $2.520. So let's see what this one says. But that woman told me I, she had just put these out, 2520. They're both dated the same. And the woman I was chatting with at the back said, Oh, I just put those out. She said, Those probably won't last long because there were a couple more in there. And then when I got up there, she's like, Oh, it's according to who puts them out on, uh, on the floor on what day to the price. But I'm like, Well, there's two different prices. The woman told me she just put them. Put them out. So, but she still charged me three fifty for one of them and two fifty for the other one, cause that's what was on them. So, I didn't argue with her. I just let it be, let it be. Sometimes you have to let it be. But anyway, I got those for our little grandbabies. I don't know if I'll keep these and give them to them for birthdays or whatever, or I might just give them to them next time I'm around them. I'm not sure, but I love picking up new things from Goodwill or any thrift stores that are in good shape. The packages, packaging is in good shape and stuff. And, uh, you know, give them, give them out as gifts. It saves, saves me money. So, why not, right? <clears throat> so, anyway, that's everything. It wasn't a whole lot, but I did get some goodies today. And, um, of course, y'all know I love sharing it with you. But that is everything that I got. So, I hope you enjoyed this little Goodwill thrift haul. If you did, y'all give me a big thumbs up. Y'all leave me some comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already. If you are, I appreciate you so very much. Um, also, hit that notification bell if you subscribe. That way, you can be notified when I upload new videos. And I guess I'll see you in my next one. 
Happy thrifting! Bye!